Hello everyone and welcome back to the Pillars of Eternity Let's Play. Wait a second. Oh, whatever. Uh... Okay. We're going to Defiance Bay. And the last time I said I would skip these loading screens once I get there before I started this video, I lied. I actually didn't lie, I forgot, because I have such short-term memory. I started this video immediately after I said that, and I still forgot. Oh, I'm so terrible. I'm a terrible person, guys. I'm so sorry. I'm not a terrible person. I'm amazing. But I am sorry. I'm stupid. <laughs> Forgetful. Can I steal that? Okay. Okay, I am looking for... Let's do a... Uh... Eater's path, path first. This room says this is a defense way. Like the records in an arcade in the Ducal Palace. So I did come to the right place. Ducal Palace is right here. Let's take a look. Hopefully they don't mind that we're here so late. Like in the middle of the night. Just the cars. Greetings. We're just gonna stroll in if you don't mind. Oh, I need to reset my watch. There. A character can use quick items or switch between weapon sets during combat, but is otherwise unable to access inventory. Dumb. But oh well. Sidley. Welcome to the Ducal Palace. Hail and well met. Young woman wears a simple but well-tailored uniform. She watches the comings and goings around her with quiet attention. Any news to share? Or are you just here to see the Ducal Palace? Uh, nothing. Goodbye. Here. For my own purpose, so is this the archives? I'm gonna suppose this is the archives up here. This is a very pretty place. Very red and uh, white and records keeper. Hail, traveler. Yes? Is there something I can pull for you? I'm looking for militia records from the time of the Saints' War. And if I had what happened to someone. We've had a number of inquiries about such information. I'm afraid we've had to bar access to the public. Seems there are still quite a number of folk in the Deerwood who bear ill will toward bad sons. It would be irresponsible to surrender their names to just anyone. Many came to settle here as refugees. Perhaps if you were more established in Defiance Bay, things would be different. But I have no reason to suspect you to be any different from the others. We've come a long way. Just need to find about my brother. I don't even know what side he fought for. You must understand. I have heard many such stories. I'm afraid there is nothing I can do for you. <sighs> hey. Records Keeper was unwilling to show us records from the Saints War, citing concerns about vengeful Deerwoods hunting down red certain refugees. Further, things might be different for my reputation in the city stronger. Of course. So I have to get better reputation in the city first? Well, that's stupid. Like, pfft. I'm looking for some records. I'll pay you. I'm not even against any of these whatever you're calling it. I'm a death god like from who knows where. Examinal Plains. Which, apparently, I'm not even sure if it's a part of the map we're on currently. <sighs> Alright then. Alex mentioned that Defiance Bay has an entire institution devoted to the study of illness of the soul. This must be the same place I saw in the Acolyte's vision. I may be able to find someone who there who knows about awakened souls. Should be... Where? Where would that be? Entire institution. I want to assume Heritage Halls or something. But I'm going to head over that way. Heritage Halls. 15 minutes to get there. That is fine by me. 
Hover over the spell icons on any character's portrait to see what spells or abilities are currently affecting them. Look to all backspace. Just turn around, Traveler. Heritage Hall is closed. Um, excuse me, what? It's closed. Greetings. Sorry, but this district's closed by order of the Duke himself. How do I get inside? Trust me, you don't want to, the guard shrugs. But if you were really set on seeing this for yourself, I suppose you'd have to get permission from Ryla at the keep at in first fires. Was there anything else? What's going on in there? Both guards look at each other. Look, even if I were allowed to tell you, I don't rightly know. All I can say is that whatever it is started about two months ago. The guards that closed the gate talked of something unnatural that still wakes in them in the middle of the night. I don't want to know any more than that. Weird. I am genuinely, genuinely curious about this now. Oh, this has to do with the main quest. That's probably why. <laughs> the tower I saw looms above the wall surrounding Heritage Hall. I see. I need special permission to keep in first fires. Okay. The keep. Crucible keep. I'm guessing that's what it is. So, speak keep. Safe with use focus. Yes, we know. Understood this for since the beginning of the game. Okay, crucible keep. Way over here. Think obsidian for fast mode active. B. Press enter to input a command. Hello. No commander script. Hello, accepting. Zero parameters exists. What do you mean? You mean this isn't an F acceptable parameter? As your party grows in size, you may want to change their formation. I don't want to do that now because we only have two melee fighters. If we had three that I would normally use, I would change it, but as it stands right now, I don't want to change it. Actually, hmm, what, bring, what business brings you to the key? Good day to you. Okay, we're just looking for Wyla. We're not going to talk to you for now. In here. Current, a cipher duly appointed and employed by Dunrod Rowe. Does hereby certify that Navi A. M. Penhelm has been found to have a soul free of any subversive influences or tainted essence. Interesting. Where do we find what's her face though? Ugh. No, this is not very happy today. <clears throat> Excuse me, sorry. Is she in here? Nope. This is a symbol of Ibidon. Fossil smithing hammer imposed over a circular gear. It's smooth and bright with buffing oils. Fascinating. Nothing on the altar. I can never not hear that woman saying, Thank you, thank you, in the repeating ambient sound of the game. I'm very sorry if now you'll never be able to unhear it whenever it happens, because it's probably the most repetitive sounding one you can hear, and it's very annoying. At least it gets very annoying. Oh, this is sand. Why would you put sand inside? Hmm. If this is about patrols, my novit... My, my novitiates 
I know of it. Yeah. are already stretched to their limit. Between the refugee influx and the mess at Heritage Hill, I simply don't have any units to spare. After a pause, she looks over at you again. I'm sorry, was there something else you need? Is something wrong at Heritage Hill? She lowers her voice. What isn't wrong is the real question. A whole district of walking, flesh-eating corpses. We sealed the area two months ago, just after I lost one of my finest commanders there. Yet this is the second guard rotation to disappear. There are already enough rumors about the place floating around the keep without my soldiers whispering about these disappearances. She shakes her head. I'd just as soon abandon the district, but if those monsters should find a way out... I could look into it. She steps back and regards you. After what I've just told you, you want to go to Heritage Hill? I've lost trained soldiers there. Why should I let anyone in? <laughs> hmm. The train knights have nothing on me. I think he would go with the passionate response. That sounds the most right. If people are disappearing, someone's got to figure out what's happening to them. If you're so eager to rush to your death, I won't stop you. She quietly looks on at the note. Novicius. And if you're somehow able to pull, put a stop to this, you've got my permission to enter Heritage Hill. I'll send word to the guards at, at the gate. Farewell. Yeah, sure. You won't be seeing the last All of right, me. Then. Abattoir. I'm really liking that name, Abattoir. For a death god like that, just kind of fits. And it just means slaughterhouse, really. So. And he's done the most damage, too, so technically that is also correct in the literal sense. I am a slaughterhouse. Hear me. Rockenberry. That almost reminds me, this kind of sounds like, uh, what's it called? Oh, Lord of the Rings, Buckleberry, Buckleberry, Berry. <laughs> but nope, that's Lord of the Rings. This is Eora, or Pillars of Eternity. Okay. You will let me in. You don't need to see our identification. Hello. Ayla sent me, looking into the missing guards. So, you're the one she sent word about. The guard looks you up and down, frowning. I was expecting her to send in a whole squad of just guards. Not that I'm volunteering, mind you. I'll have the gate opened immediately. Just watch your step. I'm afraid we can't send anyone after you if this goes badly. Okay. Any ideas what might have happened to the other guards? None. I have no desire to find out if you catch my meaning. The ones that disappeared weren't the deserting type. The worst part is, both times the watch disappeared, the next rotation found the gate unlocked. I don't know whether they went in or whether something got out, but if it's the latter, refugees are going to be the least of our problems. Farewell. This entire raid. What did he say? This entire district smells like a tomb. Skeletons didn't do that. Oh, yes. Boy, lots of bad things. Oh my. What the? Heck? My worm companion followed us. Go close the door, Claren. I don't need these guys escaping. Think of the children. Apparently Eater wants to talk to me. Yes. Yes. Indeed.
Okay. Marathus! Cool. Oh, not cool. There's skeletons everywhere. Not good at all. Muscle bone. Of course. Hey, I think this is one of the areas that was had a screenshot of, of from the beta. Something. Get into the house. Let's talk to Eater. Strange place for a shrine to Abidon, Crucible Keep. Maybe it made more sense at some point before it gathered all that dust. And the only thing the Knights of the Crucible worship these days is the nobility, as far as I understand it. I knew some soldiers who got recruited by the Knights after the war was over. They told me some about it. They get these young kids in there and they tell them about blacksmithing and about the revolution and about tradition. Talk about Gollum like he created the Crucible Knights in his forge to go win Deerwood's independence. Talk about the Gollum. Then they join and it turns out all any of those knights ever talks about is when are we going to get recognized as a real knighthood? When are we getting our titles and our land? Our High Justice wants to be an Earl. It says it's Ab Abaddon's will. It's got a castle and an army. I wonder how long he'll wait before he starts a war over it, saying Abaddon told him so. Or Abaddon told him to. <laughs> and the nobles was found that, that their gods told them that they're the only true nobles. The trouble with having all these gods is you've got support you've got support no matter how dumb your ideas are. Maybe we had the right idea of blowing up some of them. Less of less of them to hide behind. Hmm. Only they can be nobles? I doubt that. All men are born free. Hey, alright then. And equal. Oh man. Those are scary creatures. What is it? Uh, hit this one instead. So much for you. Yes. Here. These guys. Well, yes. yes. Oh, again. Much for you. Following your lead. Hmm? Yes. Magic missile. Lava. The unseek. Probably gonna get really badly hurt. Yes. Huh. He's down. Yes. Sort of. Well. Yeah, let's blow this one up again. There we go. Oh, now they're all dead. Okay. Some of them want to die. All right then. This is crazy. Get back. Yes. Yeah, the pathing in this game still isn't. Best. What is this? That's okay. Stern, pistol. Bam. Of course. I don't know, just imagine how much damage a uh, what's it called? Keeping an eye out. A uh, rogue could do with a pistol or an arquebus. They're uh, attacking a flank or prone or whatever kind of enemy. Oh, hey, look, more gravestone thingies. Excellent. Okay. Kyrdren Inkblot Swift, student of the renowned Ilda 
you know, Denak, Adventure, Extraordinaire, Incorrigible, Mountain Beck, and Wandering Scald. Hey. The Iron Garden will rise again. I think you mean the Iron Giant. Mora's Ultima Linea Rerum Est. Don't know what that means. Here lie the remains of Jade Malo, a skilled archer taken far before his time, or her time. Buried with her most prized possessions, including her beloved bow, personally handcrafted, and her now empty coin purse. <laughs> this darn game will be the death of me. Indeed. The road goes ever on and on down from the door where it began. Far ahead the road has gone and I must follow if I can. They are talking. That is very true. It's part of one of the songs that Bilbo sings. Human male with long hair and studded leather. The writing is too weathered to read, but he appears to have been some kind of general. His title is unfamiliar, but his features seem somehow savage. Savage. He's an Indian. I don't know. A washer of ill repute of some remote inn met an untimely demise while trying to clean. These pantaloons will be the end of me, he said, and then a wet sleeve hit him in the head. Okay. I'm gonna live forever! Born April 12, 1982. Died April 1st, 2020. 2121. 21. April Fools! Jonathan Duda died in the service to his country at the blank of blank from a blank to the blank while attempting to blank the blank. Memorial redacted for reasons of national security. <laughs> Forever lost, yet destined to return. Journeyman, nothing. Darn it. Mark T. Hopkins. I love you, Dad. I hope you are proud of me. Oh my gosh. It's not a so long wait for the eternity. Oh yeah, right, it was forever. Hi, Katani. Thought he would live forever. The universe had other ideas. Always does, doesn't it? Never forget, death is only the beginning, especially for one of my kind the band to the battalion brothers forever cool i have lived a thousand lives and i've loved a thousand loves i've walked on distant worlds and seen the end of time because i read yeah reading is good folks Great. If thou not that one blew up and there's a lot more here yeah. Yes. Let's blow this one up. How may I help? They help by blinding these stupid things. So much for you. Push guns and then shoot this one. Of course. Oh, of course you have to reload both your guns. Hey. Yes. Well. Oh crap. Hey. Ooh! Spell word amulet. Spell defense bonus. And that's a lot of golden dukes. We've got money! Lots of, lots of money. And defense against spells. What's this do? Gives me two perception. I think I'll keep the perception. Thank you very much. Uh, we'll give him the spell protection. Could use it, honestly. He doesn't need a cloak either. Oh well. He can have the cloak. Hey, it actually fits on him for some reason. 
Hey. All right then. Okay, what does this say? Cross hatch with claw marks score this vault. Interesting. Anyway, I think it's about time to wrap this video up. So, oh, thank you for watching, and I hope you enjoyed this episode, and we will see you next time. Hopefully. You better come back.